How we doing YouTube? NC Hill here. Uh, the middle of February. We're in the middle of a snowstorm here in North and South Carolina. I don't know if you're aware of that, wherever you're at. But uh, they're projecting six inches of snow here with an inch of ice. If we get ice in this area, I am most definitely going to be without power. I just know it. It always happens. And without power means I have no heat, no water because I'm on a well system. And being prepared is, is, is just as much about that as it is SHTF, WROL, end of the world, zombie apocalypse. I mean, being prepared is about being prepared for anything. And what I want to talk to you today is about information preparedness, radio preparedness. Can you gather information? If the power goes out and you don't have a TV, how will you know what's going on? Well, I am a licensed ham. I have a ham radio. I know a lot of people are into ham radio and want to learn more about it. I've got some videos coming on that. But a lot of people don't want to give out that information. They just want to listen. So having an emergency radio that does does uh, shortwave or just picks up the, uh, the, uh, the weather channel, the weather channels, is a great thing to have. But, or a scanner. Like with this scanner right here, I'm sitting here listening right now. I can, this is a unit in Bearcat. And I can listen to the local Skywarn on the repeater here in the area. People are calling in with right, uh, the temperature in the area. Amount of snow they've got, what's coming down, snow, sleet, ice, and road conditions. I can gather a lot of information with this. Yeah, you must be inside your office, 25 degrees. All right, Dave, thank you for that at 1413. So that right there is just people calling in, reporting what's going on in their local area. Ham, ham operators, ham radio operators. I can also pick up FRS, GMRS, MERS, uh, police frequencies, emergency, CB. I can pick up a lot of stuff with a scanner. I also have a handheld uh, HT 2, two meter, 70 centimeter radio that can pick up basically the same thing. Rock Road. So we can hear. Miles due north of the airport. Uh, so we can hear what's going on there. We can also tune in local repeaters. Uh, I can pick up the uh, NOAA. With a temperature of 28. Snow is falling with a temperature of 23 at Hickory, 24 at Shelby, 22 at Statesville. And so I can get all my weather information. So just something to think about. I've got some. I've got some videos coming out on different radios. I've got a ton of different radios I want to show you guys that you can use. And uh, I'm gonna sit here and enjoy the snow and and eat some chili and prepare for the power to go out because if we get an inch of ice in this area. I guarantee you, I'm going to leave it out power. Hey, thanks for watching the videos. Uh, as of now, I will be traveling with Such Double Zero down to Going Gear in Atlanta next Saturday. I believe that's February 22nd, so I'll be there too. If you want to come check it out here, Such is going to do a uh, like a bug out bag, get home bag seminar, something like that, a preparedness bag seminar, whatever you want to call it. So it should be a good time. Come out and check us out if you're in the uh, Atlanta area. And it sounds like after that ice storm two weeks ago, and now some of you guys in Atlanta probably need to be a little better prepared. Uh, till then, be safe, be careful. NC Hill, I'm out. I can't believe I did that whole video in one take.